Hey, for the people that have never been in Long Island, that is the Long Island north of New York City, north of the big city, I'm going to make like a little tour for all of those people that does not know how Long Island look like. This is a little tour in Long Island and uh, I'm going to now tilt so you can see the houses in Long Island. This is uh, this is Long Island houses and I'm going to drive slowly so you can see the lifestyle that the Long Island people do have. That is a typical Long Island community. It's not gated community, but it looks very nice. The houses are pretty massive. There is a lot of trees, a beautiful, beautiful nature around these houses. The houses are, as you can see, the style is, uh, well, different styles and different variations of materials are used here but generally these are wooden houses with stone or brick bases there you go there is one here in like a little like a little castle they all look the same little castles like couple of hundred square feet to couple of thousand square feet, the base, plus yard, plus uh, plus like a little, uh, but also I want you to pay attention to the streets, how well and uh, nicely organized the streets are. There are a lot of trees. There are a lot of trees and as one man said, when there are trees, that means good money. If there are trees, there's another house. Nice. A little castle. That's another one. And here also, there are a lot of kids running around because these people, these people that live here in these houses, they are pretty successful. They are professionals. Uh, they live here, but they work in New York City. They make tons of money. Let's say a person that would live here would make like a minimum a hundred thousand to hundred thousand dollars per year. That would be the minimum. If you don't make a hundred thousand per year, you cannot even think about to come and live in these areas. Uh, well. A lot of flowers, very well decorated streets, nice houses, nice little castles. And everyone here knows everyone. Uh, this neighbor knows the other neighbor and the other neighbor knows the other neighbor because it has to do with the family. Uh, all these people go to the shopping mall which is around their shopping centers here, shopping malls. And around the shopping malls are the are the entertainment places like the movie theaters. So this is in other words, this is the residential part. I just make a little I just made a little loop around this like little fraction of about 20 30 houses. You seeing here about 20 30 houses. Now I'm gonna go on across the street this I'm now crossing the main street as you can see on the screen this is the main street and now I'm gonna be crossing in another little street that is we're gonna be of course the main street here you will notice this is Broadway it's called Broadway any main street in Manhattan is called yeah you see the sign Broadway any main street is called Broadway in America in every town of America there is one street called Broadway, Broadway, and here is again, like that's a different type of little house, and then it's like a little bit bigger house. Next one is massive. Now, 
I will go around because on the left side that not the camera is showing you it's another house completely different architecture but uh, this is the situation here in Long Island City this is the lifestyle everybody is taking care of their bushes the gardens uh, this house this type of houses they take a lot of maintenance of course so if you're a rich person you pay somebody and that is not typically the rich rich area this is like where the poor people of Long Island live there are areas in Long Island that are like ultra ultra expensive like for example the house that you see now okay now let me give you an example hey over there there is a house coming that house here should be like a million or something like that I do not know the prices but if it's in certain areas of Long Island, like the Hamptons, that would be five to six times more than the price of this area. So also everything varies here. You can also see the vehicles that these people have. They are all brand new vehicles, uh, luxury, semi-luxury or normal, you know, nothing special, nothing spectacular, but all their new vehicles purchased this year last year or maximum two years ago now I'm crossing another main street and uh, now there are more houses here I'm mainly focus on the houses because you can see how the houses look like they have nice yards yeah there is one Tesla here but there are some muscle cars here and some because I'm driving very slow people are getting a little bit angry on me on my uh, think about I'm doing it because this is a video about how the Long Island people live informative video for those people that are not from United States of America and even for those people that are in United States of America but they've never heard about or never seen it maybe there are people in uh, uh, Kentucky or maybe there are people in uh, Arkansas that have no idea what is going on in Long Island this is the Long Island and there's like a little commercial area here like a little mall very fine well done and uh, this is where people come this is like the little center of this little community here I do not know the name of this city but there is everything what a human person would like to have there is shops there are entertainment there are night bars there are nightclubs there are, um, a lot of things there's one thing missing like if there is a bar they would be like one or two bars for the whole community they will be not like in New York City hundreds of hundreds of bars on every corner of the city uh, here but the basics are here this is like like a little main street again like uh, little businesses here CV pharmacies on the other side as a movie theater I guess called backstage yes or something I do not know uh, and uh, that's it pretty much but I want to focus your attention on the houses because what makes this up oh, there is a Indian church here there is a all these churches also are very popular the churches are very popular in America you can find any kind of church in any kind of neighborhood and in some neighborhoods you can find uh, in, in a small village even in a small village in, a, in America you can find 10 churches all different type of churches maybe there are 500 houses but there are already 10 churches so church the church is very popular here in the United States of America there you go uh, another house coming up yeah that's a nice stone brick house they call it brick house uh, we are again on Broadway so I'm gonna make another turn yeah so these are the houses in Long Island in this particular area they are not houses like grandioso they are normal houses let's call 
one family house this is called here one family house and believe it or not I saw this building and I asked somebody and they told me this is an apartment building now this apartment building here you will see this is apartment building is the same building that has been apartment building yeah just the same building like in New York City you're gonna see hundreds of hundreds of hundreds of thousands of buildings in New York City just like that but here the interesting part are the houses the houses are nice here but they are apartment buildings you see there's a house here and right next before it's a building and there is a yellow yellow cab driver who is now because he saw this house he wanted to take a photo of the house he took a photo of a house I could not catch him but he liked the house of his customer that he just brought here and how he's taking because this yellow cab driver he is dreaming is a, a Bangladeshi guy hard-working Bangladeshi or Indian guy and he is dreaming about this house himself he wants to get the American dream that's the American dream you see that house that's the American dream there's another one American dream now I'm gonna show you right here so anybody when they see this type of houses anybody like immigrant like myself they get poisoned by this idea that this is the American dream the house the yard the bushes in front the trees the nice car there's like many many American dreams here in Long Island and yeah they do exist so now I'm gonna make a turn here because there is a stop sign I wanted to show you another house but well now we're gonna go somewhere else yeah these are the American dreams now I hope the quality of this video it's okay I'm driving slowly around these American dreams that's a typical American dream now the typical American dream will show up this is how it looks like the American dream that's the car in front of the garage a baseball uh, not baseball basketball thing over there yes that is the house it's a massive house not so massive I mean but like for one family that's like you can you can play football inside this house it's a long long house it's just one story house now you may say well this is just one story house but it's a big footprint on the floor but they are sometimes they are houses like super massive I'm gonna make another video in other areas of Long Island for example the Hamptons there's another house here uh, it's a one family house there's like probably 10 rooms in this house two floor house there are three floor house there are four floor houses but that's the typical one is two floor two floor is the most popular on the ground floor is the family on the top floor is usually the kids sometimes the kids are in the basement uh, or the basement it's it's not like what you think a basement where you put your products for the apocalypse no a basement is a nicely done large area a room like like a living room like or like a bedroom like basements here could be amazing in some of these houses now I'm gonna turn around because there is a house here in construction and you can see how this house that is a very little house but now while I'm turning here you will see how the house is being made let me turn around and now there are cars coming so I have to go fast that is unfortunate but now let me turn around so you can see I'm gonna back off in the main street a little bit so you can see how this is done now I have to turn the camera while I'm waiting I'm gonna okay you see this is how the house is done this is like the wooden construction they are making extra something in front of this house and then they are gonna put the top layer of the house and they will beautify it. this is a uh, this is a called uh, rehab they are rehabbing this house they are making from this old house a new house that's called rehab in America and there are people that just do that 
they buy this house very cheap, let's say for here in this area, that should be for two hundred, three hundred thousand dollars and they're gonna make it better and more beautiful. You see, there is a, a machine there, uh, like, a, like some kind of a sunny machine and they're gonna make this house and they're gonna sell it for a million of dollars, for one million or maybe Maybe from if they buy it for 300, they're gonna sell it for 500 or something like this. Whatever they buy, it, they're gonna almost double the money. There's a, a other houses here. That's a nice house over there. This is in the main street. You know, houses here on the main street they don't cost more than the houses in the hidden street. So we want to be in the hidden street we don't want to be on the main road nobody wants to be on the main road here so now we're gonna go to pine street and then i see another yeah did i go here yeah these are like the wooden like houses there are like more houses here i think i went through here i don't remember yeah that's yeah i was definitely here so i'm gonna turn around and i'm gonna show you abandoned house now that house there, it's a brick house, solid construction. Now I'm going to turn around, and while I'm turning around, okay, I'm going to turn over there so you can see. Another house in the process of rehab. Okay, it is coming now. I'm turning around, and there's this, hop, a corner house over there. Let's see if I can zoom a little bit. Okay. That is called rehab. There is an extra room built on the top of one room. The house is massive, brick house, solid. And there is a wooden room built on the top of that. You see? Okay. There is a solid construction. And then a little bit of, a little bit of extra room made out of wood. And then the most popular construction material called sheetrock in the United States of America. The sheetrock will go around the walls. Isolation would be placed in and that's it. But now I want to show you like almost... Okay, that's a, a row of houses right here behind this nice well-trimmed bush, bushes with a nice green yard and the grass. Uh, also, the grass is always greener in the other people's houses. And now here, this is the abandoned house, the white house that you see right now on the screen. Looks like almost abandoned house. That might be very well a uh, busy house in certain areas of the world. But here in this neighborhood, this house, it's like abandoned house. You see, uh, there are signs, for example. Now, okay, I'm gonna zoom in, you will see why this house is, it looks like abandoned, right? Now I'm gonna try to show you, you see, there is the paper on the door, the paper on the door, the number is handwritten, nobody has this handwritten, there is the, the door itself, it's not good. There's a lot of things that are not good in this house. Now, if this was in my hometown, in my country, that house would be a perfect house for somebody to live in that house. But here, that is like abandoned property. Okay, you see? The frames, let's see. The frames on the top floor. Yeah. When they're gonna buy this house, when they buy this house, they're gonna first paint the house. It's a white house. It's a nice white house. I love the architecture, the way, the way it's constructed. It has a good look, but it looks like abandoned house for this, for this neighborhood. That is like the abandoned house. Okay, now I'm gonna tilt the camera again because I'm driving around, and that's the abandoned house. But it has a yard, a little yard. It's just nobody lives there, probably. The sign for sell is missing somewhere, or maybe. Uh, that's a different house. Right after this, that's a pretty decent brick house. Nice brick house. 
Okay, now I'm gonna zip in and I will go quickly to some other like little area like that. The video is already 20 minutes. Wow, my goodness, 20 minutes of footage about how the people in Long Island north of New York City, like the big city. The big city of New York is about 16 million people. It's a big thing. But most of the people that live in New York, uh, not most of them, but some of them live in these areas in Long Island. Long Island is it is hundreds of hundreds of times bigger than New York when it comes to territory. If New York takes I don't know how many square miles, Long Island it's a 100 times bigger. So within the 100 times or maybe 200 times, minimum 100, I'm just estimating this thing. Uh, in this big, big space, it's full of little houses, just like those here, just like these houses that you see, you see these houses, now it's getting very dark, I hope you're gonna see the houses, it's always, uh, now, it's not the right time to shoot this type of video, but, uh, well, the colors would be a little dark, but that's the typical scene in Long Island houses, this is how people live here, and that's not like a super good neighborhood. It's like, uh, oh, okay, let's say uh, the average, the average. They should be a lot more, uh, a lot more beautiful, like many, many times beautiful places. I'm going to make a similar video for a little neighborhood in Queens that has way, way better houses than these. And that is something here, this is called Temple Bet, okay, that is like a, a, maybe a synagogue, yeah, that should be like a synagogue or a church or something like that, you know, like a big massive building, like a big house. And the small houses around, this is the community. Some of the houses are very well done, some of the houses are very, very beautiful, some are not. But that is, what is it called? The variety, the variety of the world. So, this is it for this video. I'm gonna close the video if you like this footage. Up oh, another abandoned house here, you see? Like a, like a not good house with a lot of cars. This guy is doing something here, you know? The, like too many cars, the abandoned house. Uh, maybe some, some of the neighbors are parking, are using this as a parking spot. Yeah, that's a nice little house here. That's a bigger house. Okay, let's now let's zip in one of these little streets. Okay, now there's other type of houses here, like the typical American houses. This street represents the typical American house uh, with two garages or with one garage in the front. And now on this side that I have, it's the not beautiful houses. Across these houses that you now see, they are like twice more beautiful houses. I'm gonna actually prove that to you. I'm gonna zip at the end of the street and, and now remember these houses and you will see the type of houses that are on just across the street. As in America, people would say just across the street. Oh, there is one here. There is one house that is good house. That's a solid house. That was the one exception in the thing. And now we zip in on the other side of the street the other side of the street there is also one bad house the first house is the bad house this is the bad the bad not good looking house you see this one okay now we get to the to the ugly house a white house nice house but not not so beautiful that's like a standard it's beautiful but now watch next this is the second one is like okay to ugly and now these are now it comes the real houses these are brick houses they are solid they are a uh, different style uh, how you call this colonial style or something like this and that's a nice one and there's another one that is nice one yeah now we are just approaching these are like houses like uh, like a little castles, like little, little castles, yeah. 
and uh, then it's like one more ugly house now and it's not that ugly but yeah not so beautiful yeah this was uh, another little street here a lot of trees a lot of trees beautiful trees with nice color I'm sorry that now it's too dark already for this video but I just uh, end up here about uh, 7 p.m. Uh, okay, this is it. This is the video for today.